everyone, welcome to another moment in time with Taylor. I'm so glad that you're here. Hello to my replay viewers. Thanks for checking this out. Should I wear my wings? Hmm. I don't know. I'm thinking no. It's getting a little warm in here already. It's going to be another beautiful day in New York today, but it's still a little chilly where I am, so I didn't want to go outside for this part. Hi, Leon. How are you this morning? Oh, we got ants. Hello everyone. All right, let me put my hair up. We're going to be working with that same, pretty much the same flow we worked with yesterday. I never really teach it exactly the same from one time to the next, but pretty similar. Good morning, Nikki. How are you, my Canadian friend? Oh, and hello, Ken. Welcome back. Good to see you again. Get my hair out of the way. All right. Let's get some water. We'll start out with hydrating, right? While we wait for everyone to kind of pour in. Sorry for starting a few minutes late. I was watching, um, you were on vacation. I missed you too, Nikki. I'm, I'm glad you're doing well. Hey, Nikki Sparkles. Thanks for inviting your followers. You guys are slowly appearing in the bottom. Hey, Jimmy, hello. I didn't see you sneak in there. Thanks for inviting your followers too. Good morning, Jimmy. You have to take your son to an appointment. Okay. If you want to catch the replay and do the writing prompts, feel free. Um, otherwise, maybe we'll still be here when... Probably not. We won't. We won't still be here. Okay. <laughs> well, thank you for coming and inviting. I love you. Mwah. Enjoy your lip balms and your sun and all of the, everything you have going on today. All right. So we're going to start right out by... Oh, somebody's first day on Periscope. Circo Circano. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thanks for inviting your followers too, Ken. Yay. We're going to have so many people today. You were just saying hello, have a great day, have to go to work. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that and enjoy your day at work. Um, and thank you for coming in and inviting. I really appreciate that, you guys. I'm trying to get a gold badge, so it's like every little bit helps. If you can't stay, exactly what these guys are doing. Just pop in just so that I can get the view and then you can leave if you have to, no worries. And if you feel like inviting, that's really nice too. So from hands and knees, you're gonna bring your big toes together, open your knees out and start to bring your heart towards the earth. So the more important part is to get your hips back and then let your upper body come forward. Awesome, thank you. So it doesn't matter how far forward you come, you might wanna support your head with a yoga block. And these are really cheap, you can get them at Walmart, you can get them online, places like probably Big Sporting Goods, something like that. You know, you can support your head if you need to. Good. Press into the hands. Lift the elbows up. Hey, Eric, my newest band hammer member. I told you that already, right? Yesterday, Eric, that you can block now. Let me know if you have any questions about how to do it. Good morning. All right. We're going to do some cat cow. Inhaling to lower the belly. Lift the heart. And exhaling, rounding the spine, pushing the earth away from you. Inhaling into cow. Exhaling into cat. And just go with your own breath. Don't worry about being synchronized with me. Waking up the hands, wrists, and shoulders. Stretching the front and back of the spine. This is a great way to massage the discs between your vertebrae.
One more round. Inhale and exhale. Deep. <coughs> Excuse me. Hello, deep. I choked on your name. And then from table, we're going to keep our hips glued right over our knees and start walking our hands forward. Again, you can support your head with a block if you don't come to the mat. And then press into the hands, lift both elbows up, and bring the hands back under the shoulders. Good morning, Jen. Good morning, Deep. Where's Cyanide? I'm not sure. I just finished watching her replay, though. Make sure you check out her replay from last night. You don't have to be here if, you're not, if you don't have time to do both. Uh, yes. Okay, good, Eric. Good. Hey, Ben. Another new Bam Hammer member. I love it. I love it. And we got a new uh, sponsor. I found out about it yesterday. We got him the day before, so lots of good stuff happening. Hey, Tracy. Good morning. Good morning, Jayendra. How are you? How is everyone? Okay, where were we? We just did our puppy pose. All right, we're ready to come into our first hour dog. You're going to watch the replay while you do dishes. All right, cool. Yeah, it was really interesting. It was good. It was sad, but it was good. You did your yoga this morning with Yoga with Adrian. Yeah, you guys, if you're not following Yoga with Adrian on YouTube, she's got some really, really awesome videos too. So we're going to curl our toes under and lift our hips up for downward facing dog. And thanks for popping in, Jen. It helps me to just even get the view, even if you can't be here long, because I'm on my way to a gold badge, so I really appreciate you. I love her too. And I've been noticing in my videos that I haven't really been reaching down with my heels as much as I should in this pose. So make sure that you don't have your heels up like that, but you're pressing the heels down and back. Inhale onto the balls of the feet. Exhale, heels to the right, stretching the left side body. Inhale, back up. Exhale, heels to the left, stretching the right side body. Keep your shoulders level. Inhale, back up. Exhale, send the heels down and back, looking between the hands at the bottom of your next exhale, step or hop forward for forward fold. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, sweep it out and up, bending your knees as much as you like, looking up. And exhaling, hands together at the heart center. Thanks for the hearts. Inhale, sweep the arms out and up. Exhale to fold. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, fold, bending your knees as much as you need to to get your hands down on the mat and then stepping or hopping back through your chaturanga flow. And in downward facing dog. Lifting right leg up for three legged dog. Bend the knee, open up the hip, keep the shoulders level, keep pressing out through the left heel, and then inhale back to three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose. 
Back up. Knee to nose. Back up. And knee to nose. Round your spine. See if you can get your foot through. And lower your back knee. Thank you for blocking. I really appreciate that. I just saw those comments. Inhale, arms up. Interlace your fingers, except your pointer and your thumb, and bend your elbows. Nice tricep stretch here. Rotate your hands inside your leg. Move your right foot out to the side. Make sure that left leg's back as far as you're comfortable. And then maybe you can come down onto forearms. Flex your foot actively and maybe roll onto the outside edge of it so you can marinate into your hip. I don't know what my dharma is now, Deandra. Would you like to enlighten me? So you guys, if you end up getting blocked, if you say something rude or perverted, I'm going to place the bottom of my foot back down, toes forward, curl the back toe under, lift that knee up. If you get blocked, the only way you can get unblocked is if you go to femyoga.com, sponsor the channel for $5 or more, let me know your username, and I'll give you a second chance not to say anything rude or perverted. Step the front leg back for forearm plank. Lift the hips up to the sky, walking the feet forward for dolphin pose. Then we'll lower our knees to the ground and take a nice child's pose here. And continue to hold that child's pose. I'm going to catch up with this. Good morning, Leslie. Thanks for being here. All right. I see a lot of Turkish, so let's see what they're saying. Pika! Cyanide is a queen. She is. I love her. You watched her replay? She is an amazing woman. You guys, I love all the love for Cyanide right now. I wish she was here. You love her? See, we all love her. Oh, thank you, Beep. You said I deserve even more than a gold badge. You're going to make me all emotional. Just kidding. I don't really get emotional, but yes. Oh, there's two Pikachus in the house. What? Hey, this is the head. Hey, this is the head. What does that mean? Pika, Pika. All right, you blocked the twerk guy. What's this Turkish person saying? I'm still playing sports like you're in the wood. And this person says... No boca, no useless bice. And then nose is bone sound. To sponsor enlightenment. Yeah, sponsor enlightenment. Good morning, Taylor. Gang, gang, gang. Weird. I brought up egg drop on this broadcast and another boy joined. What do you mean another boy joined? Bop. Oh, that's okay. We can have as many bots in here, whatever. They'll leave as they as they end up not being needed. What do you mean? <clears throat> You're playing catch up! Alicia Alabama! Yay! Alicia, you have to do more broadcasts. I like your broadcast. I like you. Can I do a backflip? I don't think so. I can do like a sideways back roll over my shoulder, like we learned in jujitsu class. You had to bring up egg drop for translation. Wow, I really appreciate that, Eric. I really appreciate that because then you can see if they're saying something perverted or rude and you can block them without me even having to deal with it. I love it. Half cartwheel? What about half? We need half cartwheel. <clears throat> it's such a shame with the time difference, but I did notice you do an evening scope. I do, Jandra. I usually do a morning scope and then either a late night scope or something during the day. So I'm at two scopes a day right now, and then if we continue to get more and more sponsorships, I will try to, you know, increase that amount. You're usually in bed. Yeah, that's a lot, a lot of people too. Thank you for being here, Alicia. All right, where were we? We were in child's pose. All right, so from your child's pose. <clears throat> press down into the hand. 
Lift both elbows up, shifting the torso forward, bringing the knees back under the hips. Make sure your hands are under your wrists. Curl your toes under, lift your hips up and back for downward dog. And then inhale, left foot up. Exhale, bend the knee, open up the hip. Keeping right heel down. Inhale, leg back up. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, back up. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, last one, up and forward. Planting it through, lowering the back knee. When you feel nice and balanced, inhale your arms up. Interlacing all the fingers with the pointer and the thumb and bending the elbows. And then rotate hands inside the leg, walking the leg up to the side. Back leg is back as far as is comfortable. And we lower down onto the forearms. Elbows are right under the shoulders. Hey, thanks for inviting your followers, Abdi. Astral yoga. I'm going to flex my foot and maybe roll onto the outside edge, getting into the hip joint. I can't actually see what you're saying, JF Devilos. Long spine. Hug those shoulder blades down and back. Good. Then plant the bottom of the foot back down, turn the toes forward, curl the back toes under, and lift that knee off the mat. It's a praying emoji. Okay, namaste. Ouch! <laughs> and then back, front leg comes back. Lift the hips up, walk the feet forward for dolphin pose, which is just like downward facing dog, but we're on our forearms instead of our hands. And then back into child's pose. Killing ants as we go. All right, so hold your child's pose if you like. Yeah, you don't see the emojis exactly, yeah. Oh my gosh, ants everywhere. We have an ant problem. And definitely make sure that you never do anything that causes pain or discomfort, okay? Are you just gonna keep spamming us with namaste hands? You have a funny story? Okay, yes, everybody, see the comment that just came in, shiny hippie? Grab it, grab it, grab it before it disappears. Grab it, ah, it's gonna go, grab it. Okay, once you grab it, hit view profile, follow. Because right after I'm done here, she starts a uh, breakfast club scope that's about an hour long from 10 to 11 Eastern time. Dirk says, guess what's at the library right now reading for me? Saving capitalism. I don't know if you, if, I might've said that too fast. Hopefully you're able to see and hear what I just said. Ants, oh, I know about ants. You know about ants? Teach me about ants. Yay! Okay. I think I think I got all the comments. Okay, I followed that. I'm going to bed after you. Yeah, I know. It's like really bad timing for, uh, for Japan. But, yes, you can catch her replay. She's really cool. And we all kind of like go in there after this, pretty much. <laughs> okay, so we're in child's pose. Let me plan out my next little flow here. Okay, come back to hands and knees. Curl the toes under, downward facing dog. Okay. 
Shift forward into plank. And lower down into forearm plank. And back up to plank. Forearm plank. And plank. Plank. I mean, sorry, forearm plank. <laughs> to plank. Last one. Forearm plank. Hold this for a breath. And plank. Hips up and back for downward dog. Inhale, right leg up to the sky. Exhale, sweep it through. When you feel nice and balanced, go ahead, inhale, arms up. Exhale, behind your back, interlacing all the fingers. Inhale. Exhale, pull yourself forward and down. Arms reach up to the sky. Good, come back up. And then exhale, planting the hands back down, bringing the front leg back. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, sweep it through. When you feel nice and balanced, inhale, arms up. Exhale, behind you, interlacing the fingers the opposite way, so different thumb on top. Inhale. Exhale, forward and down. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, bring them down. Stepping the leg back. Downward dog for three breaths. Shift forward into plank. Funky forearm plank push-ups. Left arm forward, push up. Back to plank, right hand forward, push up, and back to plank. Left hand forward, push up, and hold here. Coming into a funky dolphin pose, hugging your right elbow in, stacking your right knee on top. Yeah. We're gonna get this pose. It's gonna happen. <laughs> Remember, I couldn't even lift up my leg for a long time, but now it's like, comes like a foot up off the ground. We're getting there. I'm a little sweaty. You can take a child's pose here if you want, any kind of relaxing pose. I'm gonna catch up with comments to give myself a little breather. Wow, right? Alicia, what, what's supposed to happen is that my, hey Maddie, hello, that back leg that kind of like <laughs> lifted up and dropped back down. That's supposed to like lift all the way up. Oh, thank you, Maddie. You're the best. That leg's actually supposed to go all the way up over my head, like totally straight. <laughs> so it's supposed to be like a half forearm stand. So my one leg will be up and then the other one's resting on the, uh, the arm, kind of like a, tr a tripod almost. Like kind of like, um, oh my God, there's ants, so many ants. Um, kind of like for what you do before you come into headstand sometimes. Five push-ups for me, what? Five push-ups for you. Oh, she probably deletes her replays, beep. You're probably just not seeing a lot of her uh, broadcasts. I'm gonna do more working out, don't worry, don't worry. Just stay tuned, Maddie, I'm about to get back into it. I'm getting strong, I'm definitely getting stronger, I agree, beep. You're in my house. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's up? Doing some yoga. Thanks for inviting your followers, Jen. What do you usually scope about? She's actually, I don't know if she saw your comment, but what Tracy scopes about right now, she's doing the artist way, which is where we got our inspiration for morning cages. So she, well, she, 
I, that's where the, inf the inspiration for Morning Pages comes from The Artist's Way by Julia Cameron. So now Shiny Hippie is bringing you through that book, which is actually a 12-week program to recover your creativity. Hey, look, we have a sponsor in the house. Hey, name, same. How are you? Actually, Taylor was our first ever sponsor for the Fem Yoga channel. Oh, she just left, but she was. She was. <laughs> All right. It's 10 p.m. It's only 10 p.m. Stay up. Stay up later. Okay. Okay, do one push-up. I'm gonna. I'll show you the push-ups that I'm doing right now. Yeah, you delete your replays. Yeah. Framework of artist way, but fun and talk. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. One finger push-ups. Starting the day off right after the workout. Yes, yoga never seems to get easier. Casper, that's not true. You just got to stick with it. Uh, it's getting easier for me. Did you see my leg lift up? I don't know how long you've been here, but my back leg was like, huh, huh. Note to self, do not put lotion on before Taylor's yoga. Yes, I know. Yesterday I was outside. It was so sweaty. My hands were like sliding away from me. Hey, name same. There she is, everybody. That's our first ever Fem Yoga sponsor. She's the first one to ever sponsor our channel, and she's probably one of our youngest viewers, so I thought that was really cool. Uh, thanks for inviting your followers, Maddie. Heart. I'm going to order the book Friday when I get paid. Yay! <laughs> oh, peace out, Alicia. Mwah. Bye, Alicia, Alabama. Or should I do this for Alabama? Okay. You've been yoging. I've been here. Okay, awesome. Good morning, Charles. And stuff is sticking to you. That's great. Okay. Let's do it. So you're in your child's pose. Press into your hands. Lift your elbows up off of the mat. Shift your shoulders forward over your wrists. And bring your, actually I want to just be back just a little bit more. Bring your knees under your hips. Curling my toes under, lifting up for downward dog. Shift forward into plank. And we're going to lower the right hand first this time for funky forearm plank push-up. Getting weak. Down. Good. And then back to the right one. We're going to hold this one after we go down. Lift our hips up to the sky. Whoa, I'm going to fall. All right, strong hands, strong hands. Elbows hugging in. Left knee on left arm. Okay, you guys, it's happening. It's starting to happen. Why is she crying? Oh, I'm just very sniffly. I'm not crying. My first walk out with the puppy this morning and I'm in pain. I think you need more exercise. No, she got in a car accident, so she has like broken ribs and stuff. What are you trying to say? <laughs> You're lovely. <laughs> she is lovely. I love her a lot. She has a really, really cool accent, British accent. Sounds Irish, but it's British. Yeah, broken ribs. Crying yoga is all the rage. Should she see a doctor about it? A doctor is only going to make it worse. I'm actually, I'm going to blow my nose really quick and then we'll do the next, we'll do like kind of the final couple flows. 